Almost all current cases of COVID-19 in Victoria, Australia, can be linked to return travellers quarantined in a state, an inquiry has heard. The inquiry also heard guards at quarantine hotels were given inappropriate training advice. Australian media report that guards were told masks and other protection would not be necessary as long as they adhere to 1.5-meter social distancing. Victoria is currently in lockdown because of a second wave of infections. Stricter Stage 4 restrictions were put in place in the city of Melbourne on 2nd of August for six weeks. On Monday, Victoria recorded 25 more deaths and 282 new cases of the virus, making it the state's deadliest single day since the start of the pandemic. At the end of March, Australia's federal government said everyone returning to the country from abroad would need to enter mandatory quarantine programs, which would be run by individual states. Professor Ben Howden, director of the Melbourne-based Infectious Diseases Centre Doherty Institute, told the inquiry into Victoria's hotel quarantine system that genomic sequencing data suggested that at least 99% of cases at the end of July could be traced to people who had returned after travelling abroad. However, he did not specifically link the cases to people in these programs or to any particular hotels. The sequencing looked at 46% of the state's cases up to 23rd of July, he said, adding that they were incredibly confident about the accuracy of the clustering. Barrister Tony Neal QC said the inquiry would aim to determine how the program was structured and who was ultimately responsible for running it as well as what improvements could be made for future quarantine programs. The quarantine program fell short of its goal of preventing the spread of COVID-19, and for some people in quarantine it was not clear who was in overall command of the operation, Mr. Neal said.